Well, it is something that seems like it could only be in a movie, yeah. but right now engineers are inching closer to bringing flying cars to reality. Yeah, right now the race is on to be the first to really take off in the space for fly flying cars. As Christian Benavidez reports, a Florida company wants to be that leader. So this is about um, 17, 18 feet. A Doroni Aerospace in Pompano Beach, Florida, founder Doron Merdinger is eager to get his personal flying machine on the market. So this is essentially a big drone. It is. It's an EV tool aircraft, which stands for electric vertical takeoff and landing. With testing already off the ground, he believes the $350,000 aircraft could soon be ready for consumers to buy. We, we already have hundreds of pre-orders. The final product, called H1X, will look like this, able to fit in a two-car garage. This simulator shows how takeoff would happen. During testing, I was able to land it on top of the guitar-shaped Hard Rock Hotel and Casino in Hollywood, Florida. All right, we're here. Merdinger says in the real world, we wouldn't land there. Technology on the EV toll prevents it from flying to restricted areas. Geofencing is essentially an invisible wall, so you can stop vehicles that want to go into a secure airspace. The company says current technology allows for about 40 minutes of battery life. That's enough to travel about 60 miles. Doroni is one of dozens of companies trying to make flying vehicles a reality. Joby Aviation is preparing to test an autonomous air taxi, and Archer Aviation has received FAA certification, bringing it closer to flying passengers. Jason Pritchard is an industry expert. We're not going to be like the Fifth Element, Star Wars, the Jetsons, where we're having hundreds, if not thousands, of these aircraft flying around cities all over the world. Very much start off small. Doroni is hoping to be one of those companies to break ground in the air. Cristia Benavides, CBS News, Miami. One day. One day. I, really, I know like, we keep saying Apple that. Apple Watch, right? Like, I wanted one so bad during Inspector Gadget. and Now here you go. It's real. Everything's possible. So, I mean, hey, yeah. 20 years from now? <laughs> but I feel like we said, that, we said that 20 years ago, so yeah, we'll see. True. Yeah.